everybody and welcome to our channel. Today we're going to look at the Hello Kitty and Friends Monopoly. There is currently another version that's an anniversary one that's a box lunch exclusive, but this is the newest before that. You can find it at Barnes and Noble, Box Lunch, and some little small stores. So we're going to take a closer look at all the pieces. Take a good look. Hello Kitty and Friends and Rio characters. The pieces are really cute. My copy actually came with two of the same character. I had two Kuropis, but I contacted Monopoly and it was super easy to get a replacement piece and get my Melody, which is the one I was missing. So I do have the whole collection now. So let's take a quick look. Okay, so let's take a look at all the pieces and tokens. This is my cover. You can see it a bit closer. We have a lot of the character on it. Shows you kind of hotel. Gives you the idea of Monopoly. Someday it's my goal to have most of the Monopolies and like clues and yachts and different games. I think they're a lot of fun. So the instructions are nice and pink, which give you that Monopoly feel. The nice little here's how you play, which is cool. Basically, you play like every other Monopoly game. That's how you how to do with the speed play as well, because Monopoly can be a very long game. And then over here is the money that's organized. They all have different characters. So like the one is Cinema Roll. Sorry, it was upside down. Cinema Roll is one of my all-time favorite characters. The five is my Melody. The ten is Tuxedo Sam. The twenty is Bats Maru. I'm not actually sure if that's how you pronounce his name. I always read things, but I don't hear them very often. The 50 is Kuromi, another one of my favorites. I probably have the most Kuromi stuff out of all my collectibles. The 100 is Pom Pom Purin. I have a Pom Pom Purin bag on the way that's pretty cute. And then lastly, the 500s are Hello Kitty herself on the orange. Don't know if I would have chosen orange for Hello Kitty, but... I guess it makes sense all the other colors are kind of taken. So let's take a look at the board. It's a bit close up, so you might not even get to see it all at once. But I wanted you to get a good view. So you do have so they'd go just visit in jail, but you have Chocolate Cats Auto Shop, Little Twin Stars. I love Little Twin Stars. I think they're underrated. You don't see as much. The Hello Kitty Cafe. The middle has a little hamburger. With the characters all around it. All your corners are kind of the same. You have your free parking. You do have adventures. And instead of like the chance things and celebrations. And then you have, this is like Rainbow Harbor. You do like the water. The utilities are kind of the same. They're really cute though. Go to jail. Instead of the railroads that we have, Sunshine Park over here. Over here is a flower garden. And the one that's kind of cut up is Friendship Square. So it's super cute, your traditional Monopoly game, but with all the Sanrio characters. So let's look at some of these. We have a celebration card. Buy your friend a small gift and have it wrapped nicely. Pay $50. Help to clean up the town celebration. Collect 100 Let's see. Sports club fees are due. Collect ten dollars from every player. Sweet treats for the community fair. Get out of jail free. So they're all again themed. More celebrations. And then here is your adventure cards. Help Hello Kitty find her missing bows. Collect fifty. Your car is due for service. Advance to Chocolate Cat's Auto Shop. If you pass go, collect two hundred. Go on a hot air balloon ride, pay 15 Again, they're themed and super cute. The backs, and the backs of celebrations I didn't show you. They're really cute for some reason, that one card is kind of bent up. Then we have, of course, the buildings. The back has their mortgage price with their little picture, little twin spa, Cinema Rolls delivery service, Tuxedo Sam's ice cream shop. Super adorable. And then for the houses and hotels, they do just kind of look like your standard houses and hotels. They're just pink and blue, though. Cuter than your Monopoly cars, I think. 
Your dice are just normal. Nothing how kitty themed, no fun colors. Just normal dice. And then of course we have the characters. So let's look at each of the tokens. So we have the Mind Melody car. Hopefully you can kind of see them well. It looks like his little seat. Here is Cinema Bowl. They kind of made them all look like little cars. But it's the characters. And Bats Maru. He looks all tough there. A few more. Hello Kitty. I like these. They're pretty sturdy. I've had some other ones that have had like little parts and they've kind of fallen apart. Pum Pum Purin. But these are nice. Let me know in the comments who you would play as. Here's Kubomi. It's probably who I would play as, play as, but Cinema was a close second. And then I actually have two of these because for some reason when I got it, it was two of these and no My Melody. And I am spacing on his name. I knew it yesterday when I made the beginning of the video, but I am spacing this now for some reason. Okie Ropey. So here's him. I have two of him and I kept them both. If you are missing a piece, they are really, really good at giving you replacement pieces. It was quick and easy. They commented right away actually to one of my videos. I had posted it on Instagram about my piece missing. They contacted me and told me how to get the right piece, so I did. And there you have it. Let me know who you would write up, who you would play as, your favorite characters. And if you want to see more Sanrio, check out my page on Sundays. Subscribe and take a look. Thank you.